Right, uh, welcome back to Skies of Arcadia. And we are currently listening to nobody. Weird, um, random, hoogity boogity nonsense, yeah. as far as I can tell. Yeah, I never really understood what was going on in this scene because they'd never tell you who's talking. <laughs> so I honestly thought it was just one person saying all these things, which makes no sense. Is is this is this the intro to Power Rangers where Zordon needs to find five teenagers <laughs> with attitude? Alpha, get me get me five <laughs> pirates with attitude. <laughs> ay, 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 ay. Oh, I can't wait for Vice's face here. I think he's got the weird one. Oh. <laughs> Never mind, they're both creepy. Oh there it is. Yeah. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> That's not the face I want to see when I'm masturbating. Get out of here! Yeah. <laughs> Who the fuck are you people? Girl. <laughs> Finally a normal oh, name. <laughs> <laughs> so, okay, so this, this ship is called the Albatross, yeah? Yes. Do you think... This may be a bit of a stretch. Do you think Egg Albatross and Sonic Heroes is, is a slight reference to this game, this ship? <laughs> I think by that point, Sega had completely forgotten that the game existed. <laughs> that was only, only like three years after this game, though. It's Sega, what do you expect? <laughs> yeah. Wasn't every Sonic Heroes machine boss named after a bird, though? Like Egg Hawk? Oh yeah, oh, it's, it's just those, it's just Egg Hawk and Egg Albatross, and Eggman drops the bird theme after that. Yeah. <laughs> Is it after, that, after that, he just throws robots at you like two times in a row. Sonic fucking heroes. God damn. That game is terrible. I hate that game. T he he. I am an anime girl. I have no idea why Bed D, D kind of sleeves the girl in the bed has. I don't know why when I first looked at. Somebody! <laughs> <laughs> you can't tell. Um, I don't know why, but I, I just. I don't know why, but I just look at her model and I just think of Pit. And I don't fucking know why. I was From like, they've got Kinnick. Yeah, I was like, he looks like Pit in like Smash Bros. And I don't know why. <laughs> I think it's all the gold bracelets and things. Yeah, I think it's the giant gold display. Oh, look, it's yeah. pretty because that's them people now. <laughs> so did, did. Oh, God, did racism. Vice... <laughs> <laughs> did, did. Did Vice appear in any other Sega spin-offs like Tennis or the Sega Superstars on PS2? Mm. Or was it just the, um... Or, is, or any of these characters in Project... Was it Project Zone? Uh, Capcom, Sega, other party, like, no. uh, RPG? <laughs> oh, okay. As, mu as much as I would love uh, them to appear in those games, they didn't. Instead, they went with char char characters from Valkyria Chronicles 3, the game which never got released outside Japan. <laughs> Success? Question mark. Yeah, that's a that's a missed opportunity too, considering these characters come from a largely combat-centric game. Yeah, and it's like so you can put the Ace Attorney characters in there, but you can't put <laughs> Vice and Ica. Okay. You know what? I I haven't I, I haven't played those games, but I do give Sega props for not just shoehorning Sonic in that. Yeah. Because, you know, obviously, I'm sure if they... St they must have known if they stuffed Sonic in it, they'd probably sell a few more copies, but they didn't, so I give them respect for that. Well, it's, it, it is an, it's more of a Namco Bandai game, so... I, th I think it was basically Sega just saying, uh, yeah, you can take these characters, we don't want them. <laughs> we have no plans to ever use these characters in a game ever again. You can have them in your little fucking 3DS <laughs> RPG normal <laughs> buy, have at it. Again, that makes sense. Uh, uh, makes me wonder why these characters haven't appeared in that game. Mm. Oh, Vice has daddy issues. Oh. Wait, so, wait, so, so his father is the captain? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I just read Briggs as Spriggs. I was like, Gareth? Really? I know, right? <laughs> Briggs, the vice captain. Well, it's weird because 
my my uh, my uh, uh, internet bills come to me as Gareth Briggs, so that could be me. <laughs> God. Time on a cable, go fuck yourself. Yeah, you you can now uh, pilot an airship and then blow them up with the cannons. Fucking hell yeah, let's do that. <laughs> I'd like to tag along for that, yeah. <laughs> so yeah, now we get to the... Really one of the first cool bits, real cool bits about this game, is that you actually get to fly your pirate ships. Please, please, this is... Oh, you know, it hasn't started yet, but I'm getting... I'm getting horrible flashbacks of the gummy ships in Kingdom Hearts. No, it's nowhere near as bad as that. Thank God. Oh, oh. What? I thought you were gonna excuse. What? You flew into that and then you. What? The, you should have exploded there. That doesn't make any sense. <laughs> That's that. You did explode. That's your grave. <laughs> <laughs> didn't Didn't you see the explosion of confetti? <laughs> it's like they're finally dead. We got them. All right. Weird that this game uses underscores in place of, like, ellipses or things like that. It's kind of throwing me off. <laughs> but yeah, so, so these are discoveries, and basically, uh, throughout the entire world map, they're all hidden everywhere. Um, and in order to get one uh, specific crew member later on in the game, you have to find, I believe, at least 30? Um... Mm. And it's not simply the case of finding them. You have to get to um, get to a sailors' guild, and then sell your information. And if you get to it first, then it counts. And you also uh, so gain a lot of money from it. So, so if you have to get thirty, how many is that? Is that like half of them, almost all of them? Like there's, how many? I how many can you not get? I believe there's over a hundred. Hmm. Okay. Then. And to this day, I've never found all of them. Wait, are those fish flying in the air? Yep. I think my pain meds just kicked in. <laughs> <laughs> so, Carter, you said other people can beat you to it. If you, like, keep your info for too long throughout the story, can other people beat you to the information and make it uh, worthless? Yes. As, as specifically, the person you're trying to recruit. Oh, that's cool. I guess it's bad if you're not paying attention, but otherwise it's cool. Yep. <laughs> So again, I know I know we, we, we slightly covered it slightly in in part one, but just just to may, maybe give me some some context. What is the overarching story of this game? Uh, the overarching story is that uh, Fina here is trying to gather up something known as moon crystals, and so she has to search all the different lands which are covered by uh, different coloured moons. Yeah, for some odd reason, there are about, I think there's six moons in this world. <laughs> okay. So, you have to travel to each location and try to find the moon crystal. But of course, there are, there's one group of people who are trying to gather them, gather them for themselves. Basically, so they can conquer the world. Of course. Yep. Uh, the Sonic I, Adventure townspeople look so good here. <laughs> and, you know, Chris, you were right. They keep using underscores. It makes everything look like computer code. I don't like it. <laughs> like, the text is really starting to annoy me now. Do we do we get to see the Station Square Burger Man statue? Is that, is that going to be one of, one of these town people? <laughs> oh, uh, they very well could be in one area. <laughs> <laughs> so how, oh. how big... How, what the hell? Oh. Well, they got to hide Love their pirate <laughs> ship. <laughs> Love it if that if that that comes down and the tornado just flies out. I want to fly high. <laughs> so how how big is is the world map? Um, like how, like how big I do you have to fly around looking for places? Um, the world map the world map itself isn't actually too big. It's 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 big enough, really. It never goes. You never really feel like you're getting lost. There's always something recognizable. Okay. So it, it isn't the Great Sea from Wind Waker. <laughs> not that it's not that bad. <laughs> good to know. Good to know. Although at least to that you get that um, fucking amazing music as you sail the ocean. Hell yeah. It's the 
floating island. They just this game is sunk the hedgehog. This is, this game sucks. It's just <laughs> stealing from SA one. <laughs> no, this, this is what happened in a timeline where chaos did destroy everything. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah, look at the booty. Booty had me like... <laughs> Timus? Timus the Gunner. Th these are Sonic characters made <laughs> for the Raider! Timus the Gunner! <laughs> Everyone, yeah! <laughs> Everyone the crowd. <laughs> what so do you how, think? How, how do you I think this is illegal. <laughs> <laughs> So, how do you pronounce Stick's name? Is it Aika? Aika? It, uh, it's Aika. Aika, okay. Though originally I used to call it Ikea. <laughs> 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 Again, they never because actually you... say how to pronounce most of their names, so I came up with what came naturally to me. Dude, I used to do that again, like. Ikea. Before, before I knew how to pronounce it, I used to think it was Knuckles the Ekidika. Because I was like, like a six-year-old who can read properly, so for like ages I called him a, a ekadicker. Just because <laughs> I like saying the word dick. <laughs> hmm. Well, that's not ominous at all. And spin around on spot. <laughs> <laughs> this must be the way to the sky deck. <laughs> <laughs> Amy, wait! <laughs> so, yeah, this is the underground area of the secret base. And now we're going to go get drunk. Oh, yeah. Nice. So, is it, would, would this be like, say, like the the main hub like is this a, a section you come back to throughout the story um surprisingly not really oh, okay the, you, you, uh, there's possibly like only like two or three times throughout the game you really have to come down here hmm cause most that Ubu's getting pissed yeah and it's uh, this has to be it's a, a, a localization change instead of obviously uh Alcohol, it's, I think it's pronounced Loqua. <laughs> I love Loqua. Can't get enough of it. <laughs> yeah, I was, yeah, I was going to say because I think having alcohol in, of any kind, like characters drinking, would automatically raise the rating, I guess, in, in the West. Yeah, it's like they don't really hide it all that well. <laughs> So they're pretty, they're pretty much about to say, like, no, we could get drunk if we drink this. Nectars, juices, loqua. A weird, a weird thing like that I can think of. Um, Harvest Moon, A Wonderful Life on the GameCube had alcohol references in it, but it was rated E for everyone. <laughs> huh. so. well, were, people, were people getting drunk or were they just referencing alcohol? Uh, I think there was a bar area, but I don't think you could get drunk, per se. Okay. Because I remember that there's an episode of, um, of the Pokemon anime where, like, Ash is in, like, he gets injured in the back and a Chansey rubs rubbing alcohol and Ash says the word, is that rubbing alcohol? And it's like, why, why does Ash know what alcohol is? This is wrong. <laughs> I, I didn't realize there was booze in the Pokemon franchise. <laughs> well, somebody had to get drunk to create most of those designs. <laughs> <laughs> You know what? I don't care what the internet says. I love. I. I. The only design of this new Star Trek from Sun and Moon I actually like is fucking Clown Seal Water Guy. <laughs> He's great. I don't know why people hate him. Yeah. Although I've honestly, for the last like three or four generations, I've thought most of the new Pokemon designs are trash. So, come at me, IRL. I don't give a damn. Gen one or should have been. <laughs> hey, I like Gen two. Gen Gen two. Gen two. I like I like the, the theory that um TJ told me about that the Pokemon games are supposed to be played in 
reverse order because the Pokemon keep dying out. <laughs> <laughs> Which would explain why Professor Oak only knows 150 out of the like 1,000 that are there probably. I do swear though, if you if you put a mustache on this guy, he looks like Eggman. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> I want to get back to see what he looks like then. Cardo, I sure hope you don't run out of cash here. Oh, I'm, I'm so <laughs> low on money. <laughs> <laughs> full weapons, full power. It's probably it's probably what why he came up with the name Egg Albatross, because he was just looking at the ship one day and went, Hmm, Egg Albatross. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> That's a great animation for getting off a ladder, by the way. <laughs> Climb up and... It's also, an, it's also an awfully weird ladder. Not many ladders don't do that. <laughs> I keep going up once you've reached the, once you've reached the ground. <laughs> you know this scene is important because there's no music. Uh-oh. We're in trouble. Hmph. <laughs> <laughs> underscore, you're a little late. I'll let it slide this time, underscore. <laughs> Gah! Underscore. <laughs> That's rich, it's, you know what, Chris? Fuck you for pointing that out to me, so <laughs> I can only see it, and it bugs the crap out of me. I forget, is there an actual... <laughs> Sit quietly and listen. <laughs> yeah, and that, and that is actually the correct thing to say, because this game actually has a rating system, and whenever it comes up with an option like that, if you say the right thing, it actually does like a little challenge, just going, ding ding If you say the wrong thing, it says nothing. So, I by so saying sit... You know, just stand there and listen. That's actually the correct answer to correct answer to the question. So what 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 happens? Or like, do you get do you get more points? Like, do you get like a better ending if you do it, these things? Or is it just like you you get the satisfaction of knowing the game was you did right? Um, there's kind of like a rating. It is a bit of a rating system. It's uh, your reputation as a as an air pirate. Um, I think it's. The uh, more reputation you have, the bigger the discount you get in stores. Hmm. Okay. I, I believe that's it. So there is an incentive to try and get it right then. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> and this is instantly enough for, to to sway him. Hmm, you can't tell me anything, huh? Eh, good enough for me. <laughs> Why does... Okay, how, how do you pronounce the father's name? Dane. Dane? I think I was Dane. Dane. I, I, I don't know, but like, for some reason I look at that model, the model's face, and all I see is MBM. <laughs> 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 like if we go back, if we go back to a close up of his face, I'm like, MBM, when did you when did you become an air pirate? Oh god, that makes this the house of MBM. <laughs> <laughs> and also the trap of MBM. <laughs> so so they they said they're air pirates. Does that define are they like sea is there still like seas? Is there still like a sea pirate, land pirates, or are these the only pirates and they add the uh, word air to sound cooler? Uh bit well. There are no real large land masses in this world. Everything's just just small islands. Okay. So, um, air pirate is just what would naturally be a normal pirate anywhere else. So like, we're, okay. we're connected with seas. They connected with air. Okay. So, so there's no like water masses at all on on this planet. Uh, there's only like a, f a few uh, mysterious pools. That's it. Gotcha. So, so no, like, oceans at all? Not really. Okay, okay. <laughs> You're too <We're>... fucking rich. <laughs> <laughs> get fucked. Fuck, fuck you, 1% to get out of it. <laughs> <laughs> Occupy Arcadia. 
I just love that. Is, is that it... I just love that Dine's got a secret bookcase, which just leads to a chest with only 150 <laughs> gold in it. It's his like... life savings. <laughs> so is is this like is, is so is the world map? Is this like just a planet, or is this like the known universe, it's, or is there it, anything outside of this? It's the whole planet. Okay. Okay. So, so there are other. I guess I'm just, trying to, I'm just trying to get a scope of of the the world it's setting. Is there other pl <laughs> <laughs> are there are there other planets or is it just like everything? Uh, we only ever see this this planet. The okay. There obviously we know of their moons, but that's it. Okay then, that's no moon. It's a space station. <laughs> uh, sadly, you're not too far off with that comment. Yes. 